And the question that policymakers and the public and, uh, have to ask themselves is this. Do you believe that it's worth spending a dime or 15 cents or 20 cents in the form of a credit to bring a dollar into the economy? If you do, you support these credits. If you don't, you don't. But don't get drawn into the false uh, definition of what the benefit of the credit is when, they, when, when the critics say, we laid out a dollar in the form of a credit and it only brought 15 cents back into the public treasury. That wasn't what its intent was. If you want to bring money into the public treasury, raise taxes. That, that's an effective way to do it. But if you're trying to bring money into the private economy, that's what the credit is for. And always remember that the benefit is how much did it bring into the state of Massachusetts to be spent on hiring actors and production service companies and hotels and restaurants. And, and when those people are here, and it doesn't matter whether it's Leonardo DiCaprio or Chuck Slavin, you know, they're earning money, they're paying taxes, okay? Leonardo DiCaprio's paying a little more taxes than Chuck is, okay? And, and, and the other thing about Leonardo DiCaprio's taxes are that we're collecting them, the state of Massachusetts, not just for the time he's working here, but he gets residuals that'll continue into the future for the next 10 or 20 years. And every single time he gets a check from Ashcliff, the, 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 that, the taxes on that check will be sourced back to the state of Massachusetts. And it never gets counted or figured into any of these projections. So is it worth it? Of course it's worth it. You know it instinctively because you benefit uh, when these films come in and you see it. And, and people do as well.